didn't even get out of town yet. What's gonna happen? Well, what's in here? I've never noticed. That's like your airbag. Like clutch and stuff. That looks like an airbag. No, no, no shit. It is. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Beat that thing back in there. No, it's gonna. <laughs> oh. How does that happen? <laughs> I gotta pee. What's up? Another game day. Well, not game day. Game day Eve. Game day Eve. Um, we're battling something, boys. <laughs> uh, I'm not feeling the greatest. Probably 75%, so if it holds... My hold. car was broken. <laughs> yeah, yeah, broke his car already. This thing, come on, pal, came off. Colton, what are we thinking about this road trip? I'm excited. I've been to Boone. This will be my third time. This is my first. Uh, well, actually, we're not going to Boone right now. We're going to Durham to pick up 700 pounds <laughs> worth of um, candle equipment for this craft show that I have this coming weekend. Which is two and a half hours away from Boone? Correct. Ah, so lovely. We're basically going to be by Duke. Ah, maybe we'll go take a visit. Yeah, it's going to be a long six hours. We're probably going to play uh, what's the temperature of the car. Because <laughs> one minute I'm hot, one minute I'm cold, but I'm not... I don't think I have the flu, but hey, hey, we'll find out. You know, if we make it to DC and I'm somehow still surviving, I think I can you make it to last. To DC. Well, I know. We're looking at your forehead. Sorry, sorry. If I make it to DC, we're like not going to DC. Wherever. If I make it halfway and I feel fine enough in this car, I think I'll be okay for the week. A little week. Do little you feel week like throwy up, you sicky? No, no, I not. I was gonna say we can get dream of me. Yeah, no, no. I don't feel throwing up sick, so that's that's great. Well, we're in Warrington. All right, a little bit of an update. I think we're about three hours and 45 minutes away from Durham. Not, you know, enjoying this road trip at all. I mean, I'm enjoying the company, don't get me wrong. Just Virginia feels like it goes on forever. We're currently in Warrington. Uh, just stopped and got gas and some more drinks. There's Colton. Still feeling about 75%. Uh, stomach's not hurting as much anymore, so maybe it's going away. Maybe it's just a quick 24 hour thing. Uh, we'll hope and pray or it is. Broke my car again. I did break the car again. <laughs> but other than that, we are how far away are we? Was was what the hell is it called? Oh, here we go. Hold on. Update the actual survey says three hours and thirty-two minutes. Barrel roll. I'm talking about tires rolling. Becca, all right, we're ready to roll. See you in a little bit. Made it. Woo! Barely. <laughs> We're alive. We're at the same hotel we were at for Chanel's uh, regional softball game two years ago. Worry. <laughs> gotta turn the whole camera around. All right. Yeah, we made it. We're in Durham. Very interesting town so far. <laughs> Shout out to Sheets down here with the Styrofoam cups. I miss those in Maryland. But, Colt, what are you working on? I'm working on uploading our show to this live stream for tomorrow. Yeah, look at Colton, putting in the hours at 1.13 in the morning. Hold on, I guess. <laughs> so, I threw my stuff away. First off, I was like, interesting trash can. And, uh... Oh! Oh, wow, it really shows up on camera. Yeah. Mm. Quality. <laughs> Until tomorrow. It's game day. It's game day. Corey's feeling in 90? About 90%. Yeah, I'm feeling better. We're good. Good night. Good night. Rest I'm one stuffy night. from allergies, but that'll go away. I hope. <laughs> so I just sent a picture of um, the coastal thing. Yeah. Someone posted it. It's the coastal uh, equipment truck, yeah. and it ran into a building. Nice. And it said... It's um, App State's old row and says, things are already off to a great start for at Coastal Football. Well, I send it to Nana and she says, Yahoo, gives me goosebumps. <laughs> Go shots. Oh, she didn't read the caption. Oh, made it out alive. Got some snacks. Very nice sleep. Yeah, $30 worth of free stuff. Way overpriced stuff, but hey, we got it for free. Oh, 
Watch out for that handicap spot. Now we got to go pick up 600 pounds worth of candle Colton. supplies. Colton, thanks for picking up 600 pounds. I made will a phone fit? call last night. Will it fit? We're not really sure. Oh, look at that, El Camino. Corey will be riding on the roof. Sprawled out, catch a fly. <laughs> Stay tuned. Oh, this should be fun. Well, we're gonna see if all this fits. This place is really cool though, it's like a whole warehouse. And then you can actually buy stuff inside here. Um, but I don't have room to buy any more things, so. Should we do like a time lapse thing? Like set it there. Yeah, we're getting there. <laughs> Let's just show you some updates, I guess. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, because we still got a chair and Colton's humongous book bag to get in here. Will we fit it? We don't know, but we did empty the skit. Things I do, man. The things I do. A few minutes later. Hi, me again. Part three of Candle Science. Well, I got everything in besides Colton's book bag. I think we're just gonna have to declutter the book bag and just stuff clothes in the back of the truck. But we got it all in. The skit's done. But yeah, um, Candle Science. Would you like to uh, sponsor this video? Yeah, that'd be great. Yeah. Um, this is this was how much of an order? Over twenty seven hundred. Twenty seven hundred dollar order, Candle Science, and I just did a heck of a plug for you. So, what more do you want? Oh, here we go. Here's here's the fun part, guys. The decluttering of the book bag to see if we can get it all I'm to fit. Getting out what I'm wearing tonight. Okay. Hey, by the way, pretty cool field trip today. It looks like for uh, Durham Public Schools. Really quiet bus. I mean, unless she just shows out here at Candle Science because she's a candle enthusiast, but. See if this closes. Closes. <laughs> okay. So, um, if you don't know what this means, let me break it down for you, vlog. I don't really, need... I don't really think I'm going to have much room on this two and a half hour trip to Boone. But, you know, we got it. We got it. All right, we are here at Boone. Boonies. I've seen enough boonies to save me for a while. Whoa, these, whoa, 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 whoa. These speed bumps are about five feet tall. And they come out of nowhere. Yeah. <laughs> Appalachian State takes uh, speeding very seriously on the campus. Look, the only thing nice here is the views of the campus. That's about it. Um, just tried to go see my... Except the view of the base. <laughs> trying to go see my famous baseball field that you always see on Facebook with the pretty leaves on the back. Because the leaves are changing pretty nice up here. And it looks like the whole team was there playing cornhole. But no access to the baseball field, so we drove up here just to see the can't views. You can't see it from the parking lot. No, yeah. Or the road. Yeah, you can't even see it from the parking lot, so... Fortunately, didn't get to mark that one on my list. Uh, 62 degrees currently. Uh, 53 expected kickoff temperature. Gonna We're be going to find parking now, and Boone is filled already. Yeah, Boone's it's three o'clock. Tuesday in Boone is a hopping place. Again, love the Tuesday night football Whoa. atmosphere. My one friend's getting here at six thirty. Well, that's too late. We'll be already in the stadium by okay. then. I want to see them come out at least. Yeah, we'll be in the stadium. So, Colton, early score predictions? Oh yes, I was going to ask you about that. So, score prediction. Um, I'm going to say Coastal. 34, we missed an extra point, per usual. Um, App State, 31. Ooh, regulation? Yes. Please. 
Uh, my score prediction. Let's see. I'm gonna go with coastal, obviously. I think you smell my I'm, Yeah, I think you. <laughs> you just smell these candles. Let's see score prediction. I'm gonna say 37, 24 coastal. I think it's gonna be a runaway. Your first coastal game. First coastal game, yeah, and it's here in the mountains. I'm still looking for the beach. I can't find the beach anywhere in the mountains. The beach chickens have arrived, but hey, stay tuned. And uh, we'll will pick... we get killed tonight? There's TBD. a good possibility. Will I'm, I get I'm... arrested tonight? Also TBD. <laughs> I'm feeling about 97 and a half percent, so we're feeling great. <laughs> Woo! Game day! Let's go, shots. So, um. <sighs> Two days ago, I decided to thaw out some chicken wings to make, and then I ended up eating somewhere else and not eating them. So I was supposed to take them and put them in a bag and throw them away at Sheets when I left to um, go get Corey and leave for App State game. Well, I saw a bag with a plate in it just sitting right there in the car. <laughs> thought, what is that? Well, our chicken came all the way from Maryland. <laughs> It's very warm, soggy, and uh, I just probably need to bleach my entire car out <laughs> afterwards. Roundabout for pedestrians. This is the first. So you can't go across here. You have to go up, over, and then across. You don't eat here. Oh yeah, so this is where we ate two years ago and Olivia was throwing up in the bathroom because she had some poisoning. And then today, Colt was in the bathroom, and this lady comes like hunched over with some old lady, and she goes, and the Lord's like, oh my gosh, you okay? She's like, yeah, she's not feeling too good. And then they left, so. Daniel Boone in. <laughs> One star. Oh, this is where I almost got mugged. Um, I don't suggest coming under here during the night. When we get out there to start. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Woo! Go, Corey! Woo! Thank you. Conquer. Thank you. <laughs> District C. <laughs> Do you all know who he is? Corey! Hey, guys. Hello. Well, we're on campus. We saw the football team walk under the underpass, as you just saw. So, you know. Pretty good. The Can't. old people are not hostile. No, no, the I'll old say. people are nice. We have got offered food. If we didn't think it was poisoned, we probably would have took some. Mm -hmm. um, let's see. Campus is really pretty. It's much, the only nice thing about this place. Much better than Penn State. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Tailgating scene still sucks. It's Tuesday. Well, it's a Tuesday, so I understand. Um, but I was here on a Saturday and it still sucked. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're just chilling out, watching the band do their pregame thing, and we're going to go in and see the stadium for the first time? Well, I'm um, for me anyway. Seven, third and two, McCall to throw. Again, a one-on-one -on -one ball. Again, a defender is behind the receiver, and Pinkney makes him pay at the one. And the Shauna clears on the doorstep. Bennett trying to break the door down, and he does. 
trying to wear down App early with all these running plays. Here's a pass play. It's third one of the game. And another busted coverage for App State, the defense. And Jamison Tucker makes some pay. 51 yards. We went, yes. We're going to playoffs. We're up 14 uh, nothing in the first quarter. What a start. What a start. We're, their secondary is being burnt every time. Grayson looks good again. So you remember the first time that we were at State? We found these two crazy people. This one guy looked at me and said, "Are you the vlogger?" Well, that's him. That's his mind. We're back in Boone. How are we feeling? Fabulous. It's 14 and 0. Let's go, Sean. 14 Woo! nothing. End of the first quarter. Corey, how are you feeling? Feeling great. Go Terps, first of all. Uh, we're gonna be doing it this Saturday. This was up 14 nothing after one. I'm losing my voice already. I'm losing mine as well. It's I usually how it goes here. <laughs> Hopefully we keep it up in the second quarter. Put some more points on. No, my prediction is 31 nothing. Well, not 31 nothing. 31 points we're just going to have. So let's go. I'm shocked. I've never been this happy after one here. <laughs> how do you feel so far? You know what? I really came out of the birth canal saying. Short and sweet. It's half time here. It is 17-10 coach. How are we feeling? Could be better. Ref really took a lot of big plays from us in the second quarter. And I'm saying it's BS back home. The PI call in the end zone down here. I don't know how it's offensive pass interference, but he had his hands nowhere near him. And the defender had him around him like this, but it is what it is. We're up in half. Moon is getting chilly. But I don't think we've scored since what? Beginning of the second quarter. Yes. Yeah, the field goal. Yeah, it's scary. App gets, gets the ball. ball. App gets the ball. Starts second half. I'm still rocking the turps. Um, I mean, it's oh, open. let's tell them about the complaint. Oh yes. Probably ten. Now listen to this. I'm like, you know, chant defense. And I have a cowbell. Yeah. And I was like, oh, here comes the cops. I'm like, oh, he's gonna yell a quote for the cowbell because they're technically prohibited. No. I got it in. <laughs> stomping on the bleachers too loud. He says the people under us can't hear. I'm sorry. Last time I checked, this was America. This is a football game, and I'm actually proud that we're that loud. And I'm uh, complaining. I'm allowed to stomp my feet. I mean, I didn't know this was like the stopo, but you know. And then he walks away, and then Colton gets up and starts saying, we gotta get louder. And then he comes back and he tells me to tell everybody to calm down. Comes after you. <laughs> but everyone got louder. Yeah. So. Hey, and we're still stomping. We're still Will we stomping. end up in jail? TBD. That's At a football typical, game? Typical campus police. You know, they're just trying to maintain the peace on a campus because their team's losing. That in typical App State. Yeah, yeah. Only in Boone does Barney Fight come to get you. Only in Boone. Only in Boone. Well, it's halftime. We'll catch you in the third quarter. Sean South. And now Aguilar, it's his turn. Wide open. Receiver, past midfield, it's Milan Tucker. He's one of the fastest men on the field. He does fumble the ball, though. And it's oh. given to Coastal Carolina. Coastal Carolina knocks off App State 27-24 as Hensley sneaks it in the right upright. What a game tonight in Boone, North Carolina. So, uh, video stopped playing after we kicked the field goal. Oh, we won. CCU, baby! We won. What was it? 27-24. 27-24. Beautiful win. Uh, first time ever here. Back-to-back -back luck, against them. Good luck, Sean. We're bringing Corey to every coastal game now. Every away game that I attend. We'll bring you to the bowl game, too. Right. Right. Coastal fans have to use a buddy system leaving. Yeah, absolutely, especially in Boone. This After place is very hostile. Go Terps. I clearly me. don't have a voice. I know, I need food, headache medicine, <laughs> and, and get vibes. the hell out of Boone. Get the hell out of Boone. We'll see you in two years. <laughs> All right, on the road, 1-1-1, 1-11 a.m.
Got shits and sheets for like the fifth time this trip. <clears throat> As we waited 20, 20 minutes? 20, 25 least. minutes, every bit, yeah. For a app sampler combo, which is an app sampler, I got double order Montreal sticks, chicken ta and chicken bites, and fries, and share one. Yeah, after waiting about 20, 25 minutes in hostile environment, because a lot of app state fans were there. Dirty looks. Here came two new buddies we made today, Charlie and Kayla. Yeah, yeah, like, well, for me, for me, they're new friends, they're new buddies. Kayla's a new one. Yeah, K Kayla's a new one. She was trying to recover from her liquid diet, as she called it. But, uh, yeah, pretty cool. Got to play bingo with our numbers, because the numbers went, like, 42 to 480 to 952, back down to 72. But, uh, yeah, it looks like our estimation arrival is 649 in the morning. We're going to see the sunrise on this trip home. <laughs> Some might call us crazy. They would be correct. Yeah. Hey, look at the bright side. Making memories on the road. One game at Shots a time. Shots up. Shots up. Man, baby. it's just been about an hour since the game was over, and the victory still feels just as sweet. Woo! First win ever in Boone. I'm sure I'll update you guys at some point during this road trip home. <laughs> Stay tuned. A few minutes later. Welcome back. Welcome back, Paul. It is almost 4.30 in the morning. Oh my gosh. You can definitely tell it's 4.30 in the morning. Both our eyes look like we're freaking stoned. We don't do drugs. I'm high, high off of the wind. High off the wind in a five-hour energy. Yeah, that is so disgusting. <laughs> my voice keeps getting worse and worse because I was doing a concert in here. Yes. And then I choked up my drink and... Now it's like I'm swallowing nails. Yes. So, uh, yeah, we'll update you when we make it to the Maryland line. A few minutes later. All right, hey, we're back in Maryland. Yeah. <laughs> it is. 6.30. Proud of you for driving back, buddy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I get two and a half hours of sleep before I wake up to edit videos. Sounds like And then fun. make about a thousand candles. Yeah, between the next two days. But yeah, I guess this will be our last vlog until homecoming in three weeks. Oh, joy. And you know, that's always a classic vlog. What is happening here? I don't know. I was wondering about this. I was just going to get ran over by a dump truck. <laughs> I was like, we made it all the oh. way back just to. But. Alright. Officially signing off. Go, Shantz. Shantz out. Until next time, homecoming. Go, Blue. 2023. Go, Blue. Go camps.